guys welcome back to world illuminator 11 i hope you're having a great monday and welcome if it is your first time checking out my channel and today i'm doing a check-in with the angels to see what messages they have for everyone watching on this monday as we start this brand new week so i'm going to use the uh, sacred destiny oracle cards and i'm also using um this card deck that I created myself, which is called the Divine Feminine Transformation Affirmations deck. And it's basically 77 cards that I created of affirmations. And I started my spiritual journey at the beginning of this year, towards the end of January. And it was from my spiritual journey that I've grown to be the person I am today. The person I was this time last year to the, who I am now is a very different person. And, uh, and even at the beginning of the year to who I am now, very different, more confident, you know, with more so higher self-esteem. I can even create a card deck. And so, you know, there is so much growth and I have a lot to thank. I have a lot of gratitude to give to Liz from Guided by Angels because it was through, you know, uh, following her channel Guided by Angels that I've really managed to grow to be the person that I am and to understand this journey for what it truly is it's not been an easy journey but you know I have grown as a person and I'm learning more and more each day and so through um, guided by angels I learned about affirmations and how important they are especially for you as a divine feminine on this journey they really help you to stay focused to move yourself from the person that you were you know we, we with quite a lot of negativity well this was my case you know i had quite a lot of negativity and affirmations you know bring you they bring your mind to this place of being a stronger person of realizing your worth and also focusing more on self-love so i was doing a meditation um, I think in Ju July or August and I got um, this guidance to actually create an affirmations deck because I had been read, writing down all these affirmations that I had been speaking to myself and they are you know a lot of them I got from the things that I learned from Liz and um, and then put them into affirmations of my own and you know so but they are simple but really powerful and they've really helped me to grow and i thought i would do the deck you know after getting the guidance it might they might help someone else and i can use them on this channel and so that's why i ended up creating this deck and also if you have a look on the side of the on the back of of these decks there is the dragonfly and um these are pictures of a dragonfly that i took myself I'm quite I quite enjoy taking photos it's something I've always been interested in and one day when I was in an in in a meditation I asked the angels to show me my animal spirit my spirit animals uh, and and I went out to to the park you know and and the dragonfly flew and it literally came and landed on a branch very very close to where I was and I went so close and I took these photos of this dragonfly and then when I got the guidance to do this came later the guidance came later from when I'd taken the photo and um, when I got the guidance to do the cards you know it really made sense because the dragonfly is about change and transformation and these affirmations these 77 affirmations that I have here are a way for you to change to transform they help you to transform from the person that you were to the person that you become so i for me in my case from being quite a negative and you know a person was unsure of themselves without that much self-love to moving into being more positive and a person who very much understands what self-love is and who's working on you know working on self-love on a day-to-day -day basis and on becoming more and more positive and becoming more of my true authentic self so th those are the cards that i have on here and i'm going to use them in this in this reading as well to see what messages are coming through for the divine feminines watching and i'm just going to read the introduction card that i have and it says this 77 card deck has simple yet powerful divine feminine um, affirmations to help give you strength and focus on your journey. When you pull a card, 
it is a message from your higher self either giving you strength or letting you know the area that you ought to remember to focus on at that particular moment it is also a nudge towards more self-love from the angels so to help move you forward on your journey to inner union and union with your divine masculine represented by the dragonfly a symbol of change and transformation these daily affirmation cards help you to work on bringing in positive changes within yourself as part of your journey towards positive transformation. So they're basically affirmations to help you with your self-love, you know, with because the more you say these positive affirmations to yourself, the more you really get them into you, into your mind, into your subconscious mind, and you start being that positive person or you start doing those positive things. So they're really powerful in that sense. And I absolutely love them. And I hope you know, you will get to love them as well as I use them on the channel. So I will be using those. So I'm got, but I'm going to start for this reading with uh, the Sacred Destiny Oracle. Thank you, angels. What message do you have for everyone watching on this Monday? What message do you have for everyone watching on this Monday? Thank you. There we go. And the card is blessings. Only one card flew out and it says blessings. And as you can see, there's a bird there, loads of color. And um, so the angels are saying a lot of blessings are coming through to everyone watching. And let's just read and see what it says about blessings. Right. So there we go. Immense blessings are emerging into your life from those in spirit. Angels, guides and spirit guardians are watching over you. Angelic intervention is available to you. Be open to the voice of the divine. Messages are all around you. You are protected. You are safe. Have faith that your path is guided. Watch for signs that spiritual beings are present. Profound healing energy is flowing to you in wondrous ways. Refreshing, replenishing energy is fulfilling your life. What a beautiful message to get from the angels on this Monday as we start this new week. Blessings are around you. Open, you just have to open your eyes to see them. They are flowing everywhere. You know, the angels, the guardian angels, your ancestors, everyone in spirit, they are sending you all these blessings. You just have to open your arms to receive them and also be able to look around to see them. So really such a beautiful card, especially now as we're moving into you know all these new beginnings it is about you know being aware of the things that are around you the signs and synchronicities the small blessings the big blessings and being open to receiving them because they're all going to come in flooding you know or new opportunities they're all going to come in flooding especially now with all you know with the new beginnings that are coming in as we move into the new year so the angels are saying you know look out for those blessings they are here they're going to come into your life all you have to do is to open to recognize them and take them in as they come so that's the message that's coming through from the angels so really great message for the start of this new week and so going on to the divine feminine transformation affirmations thank you angels and thank you um, to the higher selves of the divine feminines watching what messages do the divine feminines need to know on this Monday? What messages, what affirmations do the divine feminines need to know on this Monday? There we go. Two jumped out. What any other messages? Thank you, angels. Right. Okay. One, two, three. Oh, it's actually three, four cards. Right. Wow. Amazing. So the first one is, so this is an I am card. So the I am cards are like at this way. So there's two dragonflies and then they're the ones that are, are not actually I am, but they're also really positive affirmations. So this one, the first one is I am always doing the best I can. So, you know, this is uh, from your higher self reminding you that it is important to always do the best you can in whatever you do. And it is also a message for you to say, you know, remember to always do the best you can. So your affirmation for today is I am always doing the best I can, which is a really great affirmation. And the next one is 
I am focusing on healing my life. So you're saying today, you know, even though, you know, rather than worrying about all the things that are going on in the world or, you know, what's going on with your divine masculine, leave that to the, uh, to the universe, leave that to the angels and just focus on healing your life. So your higher self is saying to you today, I am focusing on healing my life. That is your affirmation for today. I am focusing on healing my life and I'm always doing the best I can. So that's what you are focusing on today. And then the next one is, I am a warrior who does not give up. So I am a warrior who does not give up. So this is your higher self letting you know that you should be reminding yourself that you are a warrior. You know, that's like something, you know, sometimes you may be going through the tough, tough times on your journey and you may feel like giving up and you may feel like I can't do this anymore or, you know, it's all just too much. But your higher self is reminding you on this day that you are a warrior and you do not give up. You are a strong divine feminine. So do say that to yourself right now. I am a warrior who does not give up and keep being strong, keep going on your journey. And then the last one that came out, which is not an I am, but is also a really important one because this is about self-love. And this one says, I accept myself as I am. So remember that you are completely loved beyond measure by the universe, by the angels, by your divine masculine. And you should always remember to speak to yourself positively and to accept yourself as you are because, you know, there is a reason why you are that unique person that you are. So you today say to yourself, I accept myself as I am and focus on accepting yourself as you are because you are unique and amazing. And, you know, it is important that you accept yourself as you are because there is a amazing reason why you are the person that you are so the messages for today is about accepting yourself as you are remembering that you are focusing on healing your life you know so so that you can and and then you can oh, and it's also about always doing the best you can in everything that you do and in all that you do just remember that you are a warrior who does not give up no matter how tough this journey may get just remember to always say to yourself and this during this coming week i am a warrior who does not give up so I hope that really helps guys and I, I am excited about using these cards on my channel and I look forward to seeing you on the next video. Love, peace, positivity and light.